This is a night scene done correctly. However, about the other 99.9% .9 of the time, they're done wrong. <laughs> So what's the difference? What separates the good ones from the bad ones? Most tutorials on YouTube will show you some new trick or technique to implement into your workflow. However, I'm going to show you something that a lot of you do that you need to stop doing. And that's using HDRIs, which don't get me wrong, I use them all the time, especially when it comes to like outdoors, nature, environment type things. Problem is though, in real life we have lights that come from certain directions, like a ceiling light, lamps, or even sunlight out of a window. But no matter what it is, it's only coming from one direction or angle. In HDRIs though, light literally comes from every single direction, which for like nature scenes and stuff kind of works, but as soon as it hits like that 8 to 10 p.m. mark, it just, it doesn't make sense. So the next time you do some cool dark render, try opening up the world lighting tab and set the color to dark navyish tone. Then take the strength property and set that to like 0.01 or something similar. After that, I try messing around with like spot and area lights to get the general feel of the scene. And this is before, and this is after. So much of an improvement, it's insane. But anyways, thanks for watching, subscribe, and you get a free card. Not really, not really, that was a joke. Um, no, I can't.